Lorraine Wynn Stanley into a third World Championship semi final with a win over Tori Kuish. How do you feel about that performance? Oh, I know in my heart of hearts it wasn't the best performance at all. And I genuinely believe it was probably my experience that got me through that. Um, I felt great. I just couldn't find it. My darts were landing a little bit slanty, so I couldn't find the treble. So I was having to switch a lot more than I probably would. Um, but I felt really good. So, um, But I ground out the win and onto the semis. And that's what champions do, isn't it? They, they grind out wins and they win even when they're not playing at their best. You've admitted you, you, it wasn't your best tonight, but you've got a win over a very good player in Tori Kiewish. Absolutely. And I was nowhere near as nervous tonight. When I played Vicky the other night, I was really nervous. But I think it wasn't, it wasn't the fact I was playing Vicky because we've played each other many, many times. It was the fact that it was that first round, first time on the stage for me. Vicky had already done a round, you know, so she'd got a little bit more... Uh, probably felt a bit more settled than I did. Nobody likes to go out first round, and I think I'd got the pressure on me from that. Um, but, yeah, tonight, like I say, I felt great. I just couldn't find it. So there is definitely more to come. And just a word on Tori. It's just her, her second World Championship. She's come over here. Some of her scoring has been magnificent throughout the tournament, and she's definitely going to be on to watch in the years to come. Absolutely. And she's just a baby. You know, I think everybody forgets how young she is and probably how old I am. <laughs> I've got experience in the tank. Um, the future is bright for, for all the youngsters that have played in this. You know, we've had Luke Littler and Jared Cole. You know, all they're all so young. They, they've got so many years ahead, of, you know, in front of them. Um, you know, it's a, they're only going to go up. And for yourself, mentioned earlier, a third World Championship semi-final. What can you take from your previous experiences? I think last time was the, the final against Mikuru Suzuki just a few years ago. Yeah, and to, and to be honest, I felt I didn't do much wrong in that final. She was just <laughs> another level and I genuinely thought it was going to be my year. And it wasn't because she raised the bar. Um, so that year... I ground my way through the rounds, round after round and after round. So um, we just keep plodding, keep hoping and keep living the dream. <laughs> Do you think you're playing good enough darts to be crowned a world champion this year? After that performance, no. But I know it's in there. I know it's in there. So just give me a chance to release it. <laughs> Final semi-final coming up as well. In a, just after this match we've got on. Who do, we, who do you fancy in the in the semi-final? Oh, do you know what? Bo has just been playing phenomenal at the moment. But then, you know, Aileen played great against Makuru. So I wouldn't like to say either way, to be honest. Um, I'm not one for predictions. So I don't want to jinx anybody either. So, so yeah, I'm out on the fence on that. <laughs> I won't push you on for them. Thank you very much for your time, Lauren. Thank you.